Hello, welcome to Rick's Kit. And finally, I've decided to get around to building the Harley Davidson FLH 1200. The big scale, one sixth. It's uh, the police motorbike. Um, one of my holy grails. I've been looking forward to this for a long, long time. Okay, I will get back to you when I've done a bit more. See you in a bit. Right. Well, here we are back again. Um, okay, so this is what we've got done so far. Um, we have all the frame built as well. And the um, chain. Uh, so the swing arm we've got on. And the part where the seat goes that's got a spring in it so it moves up and down quite nice and detailed for a Tamiya kit okay yep I think it moves well that would move but it's a bit tight uh, next steps in this build yeah oh you'll notice it's painted gloss gloss black should be sand back back in black frame uh but i run out of sand black so i'm having to do it in gloss black i want to progress um other parts of the kit as i go I'll go through i've got some ordered so as i go through the rest of the kit i'll um come back in with the uh, same black where it should be so uh, the stage in this kit now um, for me is to start building the engine uh, tap it covers cylinders uh, cylinder two draw the engine there the gear casing and then attaching it into the frame Put some decals on. Um, putting the chain case on the side and doing the stand. So that's that's the next set section to do. Uh, the stand is spring, it's got spring on it, so that moves up and down, so that's good. Um, Bit of um, vinyl hose got to go on the uh, gear case in there, and then that's going to come up and attach to the underside of the subframe here. Uh, where the other piece goes, I don't know. That's only one part. Yeah, this is a good kit. Tell me a kit. Not literally shake the box with this one because you have to do a bit of. Um, seam line removal and then moving on from it's not going to be in this video by the way uh, that's going to be in the next one but moving on from there uh we've got brake pedals and um then it moves into the rear fenders so end of the framework really sort of stops there then you've got all the batteries and things that so all the other bits and pieces go on if you want to see a lighted version of this done then you should go to uh shamey's bmw he built this kit and lit it up um so that's well worth the watch got a couple of videos on there he likes lighting up his kits um yeah it looks pretty cool i'm not going to light this one up i don't have the mentality to uh, play around with wires and lights and things it's it's not one of my things but anyway that's it for this one uh thanks for watching this update or well, this intro stroke update i do appreciate <coughs> excuse me I do appreciate you guys uh supporting me um so yes 
Thank you very much for all my all you guys that have subscribed and support me. Um, I have posted another video this weekend as well. Which is my um, heavy armor and uh, heavy guns group build, which is done by Marcus at Scale Models and Joachim at your your um, model bow um it's it's a red knight so take a look at that one as well if you uh, you'll need to look at that so thank you for watching see you in the next one happy modeling and for all those americans that support me happy thanksgiving weekend see you in the next one